Hello. I paid a dollar for this author signed CD at a thrift store. And a dollar is a lot to pay for a CD that I intend to purchase to resell. Join me as I research and explain who this artist was. And while a CD by an evangelist is a highly collectible, rare CD. Welcome to the Art of Flipping. If you haven't joined the channel before, I buy books, media, mainly CDs, some LPs, cassettes, DVDs, and VHS, and occasionally when I'm lucky enough to find it, some video, vintage audio equipment or some sporting equipment at garage sales, thrift stores, estate sales, library sales, auctions, in order to sell this, most of the stuff online at eBay, Amazon, and other online marketplaces. Believe it or not, our story today begins with Elvis Presley, who had 149 Billboard Hot 100 hits, 114 Top 40 hits, 40 of which reached the top 10, and 18 number one hits. So he surpassed only by the Beatles, who sold 183 million records, and of all people, Garth Brooks, who sold 157 million. Elvis Presley is credited with selling 139 million records. This signed CD is in excellent condition and is in its soft digi pack that you can see that is also in excellent condition. A little bit of edge wear, tiny bits of corner bump. The artist is Rick Stanley, who is Elvis Presley's stepbrother. And that is the connection. Stanley's mother, Dee Stanley, married Vernon Presley, Elvis's father, in 1960. Stanley would have been approximately seven years old. Stanley had two other brothers, David Stanley and Billy Stanley. And they, Rick and his brothers and his father and his mom grew up in Graceland. Well, obviously the father and mother didn't grow up in Graceland, but that's where the family raised him. Elvis died on August 16, 1977, and approximately two months after Elvis's death, Rick Stanley found Christ. Rick earned an Associate of Divinity degree in 1986 from Southwestern Baptist Theology Seminary in Fort Worth, Texas. In 1986, he also had published The Touch of Two Kings, credited to Rick Stanley with Michael K. Haynes, who I guess is a ghost writer. And that, so the book was published the year he graduated from seminary. The title of this CD is The Touch of Two Kings. And it's his live testimony, which you can see right here on the back. It explains what it is. It is The Touch of Two Kings, The Testimony of Rick Stanley, is a captivating story presented to a live audience by evangelist Rick Stanley. Rick grew up in a series of broken homes, and he found his life completely rearranged when his mother married Elvis Presley's father, Vernon, and moved the family to Graceland. In the following years, Rick's relationship with Elvis developed from being little brother to becoming one of his personal aides. When Elvis suddenly died, Rick found his life in turmoil. During this difficult season of a long time, a long time friend invited him to church where he heard an ex-hippie preach about the grace of God. That night, the one true king, Jesus Christ, touched Rick's life. He would never again be the same. Today, Rick and his family reside in Niceville, Florida, and Rick travels around the country effectively proclaiming the gospel. Unfortunately for Rick, uh, he divorced and moved to South Carolina, where he spent the last several years of his life as an assistant minister. The Touch of Two Kings, it was evidently it was printed only in paperback, and I've seen articles that mention it, or actually on Amazon it said it sold it, credited the co-author, with this book, and it sold at least 200,000 copies in paperback. Rick Stanley traveled extensively, including with the Billy Graham-sponsored events, 
He appeared on Good Morning America and Larry King Live. Rick Stanley was not part of the Memphis Mafia in, that would supply Elvis drugs, and at least some of his testimony uh, carried an anti-drug message probably influenced by Elvis's death and what he saw going on in Graceland. Rick passed away at age 65 on January 7, 2019. But collector's interest in Rick Stanley remains strong, as indicated in the paperback books sales, which still rates a 638,385,000 ,000 book sales rank on Amazon. And that BSR of 638,000 probably equates to approximately seven books sold per month, according to TSEC, the estimator on tckpublishing.com. A brief search of the listings located at least 11 author-signed copies of The Touch of Two Kings. Five of these listings were described as very good condition. The prices for the very good books range from a low of $24.62 to a high of $50. I've seen, noted that there were copies in good condition available for like $5.48 author signed, which was an incredibly low outlier, to an unsigned book that was described as mint condition outside of Amazon for $95 or $100. So the prices are kind of all over the map, and I'm going to try to stick to the ones that demonstrate the central tendency. There, the, the prices for the VG range from $24.62 to a high of $50. Bucks. The three remaining listings are all at $30 and appear to be unique listings and not cross listings. The cities where the books would ship from are different. I was surprised by that. I expected a lot of duplication in that. More importantly, this is the only specimen of this CD that I know of. I cannot find a single copy of it available online, despite the fact Mr. Stanley remains collectible, and this uh, work is about Elvis. <coughs> so what's it worth? The truth is, no one knows until the market decides. There are not any listings, as I've said, and I have not checked on... Worth point to see if there might be something from the past. That's an obscure thing I need to check in this case. I plan to list this CD for $50, being the higher end of a nice condition, author signed paperback book, and then consider reasonable author offers. Um, that's about the only thing you can do in this situation. Probably list it on eBay that enables the buy it now function and enables the uh, I can enable, allow people to make reasonable offers for the book. Thank you for watching this video through to its conclusion. Appreciate it very much. Your, your efforts helped me build a channel. And if you enjoyed this video or believe you benefited from it, hit like and uh, subscribe. And we'll see where it heads. Thank you very much.